Hello everyone, this is the panel photographer from 606studios.com and welcome to the channel. And today I'm going to show you guys how to set up your Wacom in Trios photo tablet. It's very simple, very easy to do, and hopefully this answers some of you guys' questions on YouTube here. And some of the software is not compatible or functionality wise with all tablets. So thank you and let's get to it. Hello everyone, this is the Panda Photographer from 646studios.com and welcome to the channel. Today I'm going to do this video, this quick tutorial on how to set up your Wacom and Trios photo tablet. Now they have art, they have comic, and they have draw. Different types of Wacom tablets. This one in particular is going to demonstrate how I set up very easy to set up with this tablet. All tablets are different, they all use the software differently. Now this particular one doesn't use the software, main software, particularly because of its settings. And what do you have? It says no Wacom tablet, no Wacom display, no support Wacom pin, display connected, the software is not required by and does not work with all Wacom tablets. So keep that in mind. But you do get settings for this particular tablet. Now I have other Lightroom and Photoshop. Now keep in mind that here where the 150 sensitive points centers are is where you can see on the screen as you look at the screen that this is my display. It follows my entire display so keep that in mind and you can see how I just moved all my things from one side to another so easy to do but let me show you how to set this up really quick and show you the settings here so let me lay this down quickly for you use the mouse so as you can see here this is the Wacom tablet properties this is going to help you and let's move this to this side for a moment this is going to help you program anything you want to do with this particular tablet now I set up these two right but these two left buttons here zoom in and zoom out these two right buttons scroll up and scroll down but Lightroom is set up differently and Photoshop is set up differently so keep that in mind and my pen here is also set up differently brushes on the top erases on the bottom and this goes for everything I use this pen and the tablet for based on the software now you have mapping which you can map out the display you have touch options you have standard gestures and you have on-screen control so basically this is the software for this particular tablet and basically this is how it's really easy to set up now all as i said in the beginning of this video all tablets are set up differently so keep in mind with a grain of salt that when you buy a i, I do have a wacom pro which is definitely set up differently it uses the software and it's set up different because it has more buttons more controls more sensitivity but this is more for someone that is traveling going from studio to the work office or from their home and want to travel with this or wants to go to the local Starbucks or to a coffee shop and do all their work and have the portability and you can see how thin this really is so the portability is just there for me but other than that thank you for watching everyone and hopefully this clears up a lot of answers a lot of questions you have Ray Tech about how to set this up it's very simple very easy to do so other than that uh, as I said, uh, thank you for watching. Please visit me at my website at 646studios.com where you can make a nice donation to help me make more videos like this for things, tech things related. And you can go to follow me on uh, Twitter, Instagram, uh, Facebook, and you can just email me if you want to do some photography together and you know collaborate and do some work. But other than that, thank you for watching everyone and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.